Helped it on, but only as far as Archie. Lacocious, a little grubber towards McPherson. Over the top. And a hold of the jumper of Wilkie by Ben King. He was well of the opportunity to go back the other way. And the sun an issue. And that mark has been paid. So you can't take advantage from a mark. Very good player this year for the Suns once again. Time yeah. to kick from here, El. You've got to dab it. Oh, I think he did try to poke it. Quick hands to Brody. Joyce facing the right way. And there's a free kick spotted. Plenty of holding going on down back. Josh Battle. And exploded yeah. out of there and misses the handle. So it was great play and bad play. So Nick Holman to punish. And he does. The Suns with the first goal in the third turn. Put Josh Battle against Nick Holman one on one and kick 10 balls up in the air. Battle will win eight and Holman will halve. Nine. And now the Saints are out of there. They've got the extra two. They should be able to go quick and run it into an open goal. This guy does go quick. Hind, two bounces. He's got White on. Chips it over the top, just as the folks from Clunes were getting excited about another goal for Nicholas Hind. <laughs> Imagine the National Hotel in Clunes. $3 pots throughout the duration of this game as they cheer on Nicholas Hind. But another sloppy drop mark inside forward 50. Happy. <laughs> that's what happens if you've got a, a Ruckman at 6 oh, foot 11. See, well, a kick to Bruce. Across the face of goal, Bruce eventually heard a voice. Sinclair and conversion has not been great for oh, the wingman. Chipped. And he takes some weight off this one. Up they go. Off hands. Kent stayed down and couldn't get it over the biggest goalkeeper you've ever seen. About the hands from Ellis. Well, they're out here. McPherson. Howell's kick is a beauty. And allows his teammate to run onto it. Streaming forward is Peter Wright. Can he track this one down? Savage isn't giving up here. Great chase by Savage, but Wright was good enough to finish it off. A goal made of the right stuff. Person had 50 metres, and here he does well just to chip out in front. If he's going to miss the target, miss out in front. And Peter Wright had enough time and, and space. Plenty of Gold Coast players around the ball here. Again, Weller, who was led off after that turnover a moment ago, but now St Kilda might be able to make the Suns pay. Akers going back to Dunstan, who's kicked one from 55 earlier. This, especially when, it, when he's got a record like that from this kind of range. And he's judged the breeze to perfection that time, almost right down the middle from Kent. And that's a big goal for St Kilda. They needed it. First up game for the Suns. Goes to Day, who had time to just swivel and go. And reading it best was Powell. He got rid of his man. Now he steadies. And it's another big miss. Because Clark gets another touch. Kicking out in front of White, who's back out there now, as Durham said earlier. Now Nunes looking for penetration in the kick. Membry, a bit of space over the top. There's a teammate streaming towards goal, but Membry didn't need him. And they go back to back St Kilda. And he just unsettled both possessions. Ball gets turned around and it goes to the length of the field. But Membry finished off a moment ago. Swallow didn't see. Bruce crashing in. Parker, that's a better handball. Akers didn't get the connection. You've they, got to keep it in. Bang, that is a collapse. That's an avalanche. Because they were off. Uh, that, that's a goal at the yeah, other end. That three yeah. players running. Ball to be won. Weller back to Lacocious. I got a sniff. Gang tackled. Soccer. And Joyce gets Joyce has overhit it. Trying to bite off a bit too much there as Armitage slaps it on the boot in a hurry. All the way out the back, there's a chance here. Back to Gresham, across his body, and they've snapped another one, St Kilda. They're getting a real run on now. The goal Coast in their defensive 50, so turnover again, putting pressure on the defence, get, get the ball forward, and they're generating these shots, and now, from ground level, they're actually executing nicely. So that... Clark trying to take the tackler on, spills the way of Miles, ultimately, and he opened up a bit of space for himself. That was a half chance for... And Kilda looking to close that gap even more against the breeze. Josh Bruce this time. They've kicked some handy snaps already. It's floating back. Goal umpire was interested, but it's a poster. Think up man Gresham. He had to go further afield. It was a good option. Here's Battle. Takes some time to steady and go for home. And the fans love it. Another one for St Kilda. The cutting kick which opens everything up. But right now, out of screen on the left, Josh Battle's already on the bike. You can see where he's departed from. 
That's King chasing him out of the forward line. He's just given up. And that's the... <laughs> Rowan Marshall. Oh. Wits plays on, nearly kicked it into the back of Archie. A good climb over the back and sticking the mark. Uh, power to uh, launch in a contest is good to see. This is an unusual way to stand on the mark. <laughs> so that'll, that'll put uh, Sam Day off. <laughs> Yep. Well, you can actually see the car yeah. there. It is absolutely oh, torn on Armitage. <laughs> bulging out the inside. Armour, the old fella, the old veteran that oh, <laughs> He might be done. Oh, look at it. Look still at it. You just see it go. Oh. <laughs> Come on, Armour, get off. You can feel his pain. He's going to stretch. Get a calf stretch against the post. Watch. <laughs> so the clock just kept on running. Well past the allotted shot clock, and it puts Sam Day off. No, it didn't. He steered it home. Turn away from Fiorini and find Dunstan in space. He's got support from Hind. They're getting excited again, the folks in Clunes, but he picked a teammate out again. Kick a career best in 2019. 44 in 2016 and is, is his best. This for number 23 this season, and he's second of the quarter. And it's back to one goal, the margin again approaching. To run back to goals. But he runs across the vision, which takes Hines eye line and forces. Still time for another score before the final change. Who can get the clearance here? Marshall going in low on McPherson. Fiorini couldn't flick it up to his teammate. Gresham had nowhere to go this time. And the umpire said that's incorrect disposal. Advantage paid. Big chance here, Fiorini. Over the back, all the way through, is it? Oh, poster. One, little one-two with Dunstan. They get a one-two-three and a four. Back to Gresham. Chips it to the top of the arc. And Ugh. Kent told to go back by a teammate and have the shot. He was goalless in the last three games for the first time since 2013. So no wonder the confidence was a little low coming into the day. But the confidence is sky high right now. It's back to one point. The difference. And one from outside 50, so spot on. Great start to the last. Got cleaned up then. He was just running away with the ball, waiting for the umpire. So Swallow with the entry. Big climb by Marsh, an effective spoil as well. Still alive though for Holman to go for home. Over the top, how's the bounce? All the way through. There's a bonus for the Suns and Nick Holman. 50 metres out from goal and a snap. That's an absolute bonus. And just hacks that one forward, and Brown not back on the goal line, couldn't get it. Two targets with Membry and Bruce. Looking right into the sun. Lacocious elected to punch. He tried to soccer that, and that was the wrong choice. Did it come off the Suns player, though? On the Suns player. Into the Suns leg, it did. Yeah. Yep, it's a, it's a St Kilda free kick. Yep, but it's going the other way. Oh. Is it? Now, now the overall, and maybe they looked up at the big screen, did they, and got... Can't, but they have. And the kick is a handy one. Left foot snap, so we might have to worry about it, Dan. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be giving away the, the goal face here. Memory two in that third quarter, won't bring it back in time. Out the back, there's a chance brewing perhaps for the Suns. Sexton, who's been quiet today, applying the tackle on Gresham. Swallow. Sexton now is his time. Touched off the boot again. We've seen a few of those. Marshall got it. As far as Acres, they like it in this guy's hands. Gresham broke one tackle, set sail from 55. Oh, he thought he was a chance there, What as he brought it to Grendon over. Wilkie has time to assess the options, goes for Parker. Free kick picked out, it's going the way of St Kilda. A long time in the VFL, waiting for this opportunity again at oh. AFL level. And he couldn't level the scores. Trying to find that leg speed again after that cramp in the third term. Nunes, interesting handball. It was perfect for Dunstan to run onto. Hind is ushering him on. Now there's a big chance for Parker. And in the pocket, it's Membry. He's got options. Converted from this range at all grounds around the country. But he makes a mockery of that, and he gives St Kilda the lead from 31 points down. Up on the breeze again. So that inside 50 count in this final quarter has been dominated by St Kilda. Here comes another one. Billings having a shot. The fans like it. He is all class, Jack Billings. What a huge goal in every respect for St Kilda. Just there. Go. He's thinking about the snap, but an expert handball sideways. In a hurry, they've got a spare man down back St Kilda with his lead. But McPherson at ground level had support. 
Alongside him was Sexton. Time to straighten up. He elects to just tumble it through. He knows what he's capable of. He knows what's in the locker. A snap of the footy or rushed kick at goal shooting from 25 to 40 metres in this if bloke. If you have a look at his goals this year, by Bruce, looking to play on, takes some weight off it. Membry favoured by the kick. Oh, it took a Gold oh. Coast bounce. Look out, you're in trouble. Gone. Thought his team, his opponent had disappeared. So Billings kicked a big goal on a similar angle earlier on. And he's got another one too. Big goals in the final term from Jack Billings breaking this game open. The difference between That's playing great. under 18. This is fantastic. He just forgot that the pressure, they don't give up on the chase at league footy. Under 18 kids, the, the, the player who was playing White's position is probably heading back towards the goal yeah. line. <laughs> A fumble, though, at the key moment. Allowed Parker to go in on Ellis. Now Savage gets it deep. Big chance here and reading it best. Brandon White's only kicked one goal before in his AFL career. Same kick. Cuts it. Earlier. They might have just got a bit of a... Pokes it clear of the traffic all the way back to Ballard. Oh, he turned his way into a bit of room and found a teammate. Well, well played. Two behinds today. No majors. Anthony Miles, what a strike. Yes. It's game on in the final two and a half minutes again between these two. Nicely for him as well. As though he ordered that bounce. Good fist over the top from Joyce. Legs wiped out. But now, big chance here to perhaps seal it. Sinclair looks for a teammate, pulls it back intelligently and finds his man. That's Two seconds and Weller knows that. Look for Wits down the middle. Here it is. Oh, it drops in the lap of that man again. Miles. Oh, nearly 50, 50 against Dunstan. And now the spare down back is going to take the mark. Dropped it. Sun still a chance. Savage gets it clear. Seconds ticking away. Free kick going the way of the Suns, but there's no time. Siren about to sound. Ball in the hands of the former Townsville grammar student. They need a mark here. Spoiled by the Saints, and they hold on again. They beat the Suns by less than a kick for the third time in a row.